In order to give yourself an edge in today's industry, you must present your best work in your portfolio, which shows more of your skill in the craft to the industry professional that sees and likes your audition submission. You will also need to set your availability in your calendar so you are ready for live auditions. We'll cover how to get started setting up your Talent Shopping Network account so that you can be ready for your live online audition experience with a competitive edge. Remember, the overall strategy is to submit to the audition only one item that will generate the interest of the industry professional enough to look at your portfolio. Here's how to set up your portfolio and calendar now that you've activated your account. From your dashboard, hover on Manage and click Edit Portfolio. This will take you to the Images page, where you can upload and select images that you would like to include in your online portfolio. You will also see at the top the percentage of completion your portfolio currently has. If there is any information that still needs to be entered, just click on the Click Here to complete your portfolio. To view your live portfolio, you just click the View Live Portfolio button. Your portfolio can have images from headshots, events, even snapshots from works or productions that you have participated in. To add a picture, click the Upload Images button. When you have your photos uploaded, click the Save button to save them in your portfolio with an optional caption. Afterwards, you can select your best photo as your profile image. The Edit Images tab is where you can edit the details of the pictures that have been uploaded to your portfolio. You can select in bulk the images for which you want to change the caption, show, or delete. Models and actors may want to include a minimum of three photos in their portfolios. The Privacy Settings tab is where you can set who can see each image. A good example is if you have images you would like agents to see, but don't want to share with your network connections. If you have the plan that enables your comp card, you can select the template for the photo arrangement, as well as the pictures to include on the comp card. Each template will give suggested sizes for the frames. Within each of them, you can zoom and crop the photo for just the comp card. When you add video, you can just paste the YouTube video URL into the field to embed in your portfolio. Live Recordings holds the recordings you make using the Screen Test Video Recorder and the Music Track Studio Audio Recorder. These are the only videos that are hosted on the TTSN site. This is an optional feature that comes with some plans. You can also add audio files and written media to your portfolio if you need to include those materials for showcasing your talent. All of the material has individual privacy settings that you can configure at the click of a link on the left side column. Once you have your portfolio set up, you just need to show when you're available for live auditions. To do this, click on Calendar under the left column. The screen is defaulted to the list view of your events. A unique way that the calendar functions is that it automatically shows that you are unavailable unless you create an event showing that you are available for live auditions. That saves time lost in scheduling and confirming appointments that conflict with your daily life. The list view will show all of the times you have events scheduled, whether you are busy or available. The calendar tab will show your events in a month view, while the appointments tab allows you to manage your live auditions and confirm the ones you agreed to participate in. In order to make yourself available for live auditions, you need to create an event to show you as available. Click on the Add Event button, then set the event title to name the event, choose whether you are available or busy, and the start and end times. If the event repeats, click the radio button for recurring, and more fields will come up to specify. Once you have all of the information set, click Submit, and it will send you back to the list view with your new available event showing. Now you're ready to start auditioning!